Hello everyone. I'm going to share with you a song I've written today and a little bit about the song and why I wrote it. In 2019 and 2020 I've been reading about a psalm every uh, every day uh, in the morning and uh, the psalms, as most of you will know, are the ancient song and prayer book of the Bible. Uh, some of the most amazing prayers are given voice and given music. We don't know what the music is and so lots of people have written uh, music for these psalms. And uh, I didn't set out to write music to these psalms really, but sometimes a psalm just really resonated with me and I just found myself picking up a guitar or going to the keyboard and coming up with some ideas or just getting my phone out and writing some lyrics, lyrical ideas for it. Um, this one stuck out uh, to me back in January 2020 and it was Psalm 51. It's a really famous prayer of David, a song of David, and it's a time in his life when he's made an absolute mess of things um, in a really big way. He committed adultery. And he actually had the, the woman's husband killed in battle, um, ordered him to be sent to battle. So it's a pretty bad time, pretty bleak time. And he's done, a, you know, he's made an absolute royal mess of it, hasn't he? And what does he do? Well, he comes to God and he writes a song, which is a prayer. And it's a heartfelt cry, really, for mercy to God. It starts off with, have mercy on me, O God, according to your unfailing love. According to your great compassion, blot out my iniquities. Wash away all my iniquity and cleanse me from my sin. And then um, later, um, create in me a pure heart, O oh God, and renew a steadfast spirit within me. And whilst not everybody's done as bad things as that, maybe you've not committed murder today, I hope you haven't, uh, you might not have committed adultery before, um, but <laughs> we can all identify with the time in our lives when, and times in our life when we make an absolute mess. And we have a choice to come back to God because of his great compassion it's according to his great compassion that we can come back to him and pray this prayer create in me a clear clean heart oh god and i just remember really resonating with those words at this time just thinking god my heart's not as pure as i want it to be um god will you create a clean heart in me i can't do it on my own would you renew a right spirit within me would you make me wholly yours and uh, so this song I've, I've written is based on psalm 51 um and it's called holy yours I hope it's uh, of some benefit to you today. Um, feel free to give me some feedback on it and um, bless you. From my mother's womb I didn't have to be taught to say no Sin was there in me Like a silent disease in my genes And as I grew the weeds grew to To choke the fruit within Then I saw you bring grace and truth and starts it following creates in me a clean clean heart renewing me a willing soul that I
This is my sacrifice, Lord, my heart's contrite. I know you won't deny. Open my lips, may your praises eclipse every sun, moon, and star in my life. Purge me and cleanse me from all my iniquity. Wash in me whiter than snow. Cause such elation to rise from salvation that everyone with me will know. Oh, this is my sacrifice. Lord, my heart's contrite. I know you won't deny. Open my lips, may your praises eclipse every sun, moon, and star in my Rise from